So welcome to this Doom 3 walkthrough. I know we're about 15 years late to the party, but uh, this is going to be part of a retro game series that uh, we'll record here. It's probably one of my favorite games back in 2004, so we're going way back. So let's jump right into it. Uh, I think we're going to go veteran. And we'll load it up and we'll just uh, keep quiet here for the introduction just so you can kind of soak it in and uh, we can get this thing set up. So stand by. The Union Aerospace Corporation is the largest corporate entity in existence. Originally focused on weapon and defense contracts, new ventures have expanded into biological research, space exploration, and other scientific endeavors. With unlimited funds and the ability to engage in research outside of moral and legal obligations, the UAC controls the most advanced technology ever conceived. Ooh, immoral. I'm, in, I'm into that. I'm down for that. I'm just kidding, of course. Incoming transport detected. Mars approach, Dark Star with U07063 passing through 38,000. Roger, Dark Star, descend to 2000, set speed, contact ground on 26972. Roger that tower. Dark Star. Them on radar, sir. They'll be landing in a few moments. Excellent. See that Counselor Swan is sent directly to me. Yes, sir. Tower, Dark Star on final. Very cool. We've got the Dark Star. You are set for lockdown. Welcome back. Ooh, Dark Star coming in for landing. There we go. So already we figure something's going on. Oh, Swan is uh, showing up here to find out what old Betruger's up about here. Welcome to Mars. Uh, the character. All new arrivals need to check in at reception. Yeah, yeah. The characters are pretty cool in this, but unfortunately they're just kind of a prop or an affectation. Some of them g play a little bit of a role in the game, but it's not like a role-playing Welcome game where they Mars. give you uh, any options or information or anything. I gotta get out of here. I will say that at my job. Look around a little bit. Uh, there's nothing here really, but uh, we might as well get used to these to these panels because these consoles because they do come into play later on. Does it look like I can really? Oh, I can run. Okay, here we go. Welcome to Mars, Marine. Thank you. I'm gonna need you to step on one of those red squares on the floor for a bio scan. I think we're supposed to stand here. All right, we'll stand right okay, here. Okay, let me get this started. Ooh. You're gonna need to hold still. Moving around only makes the test take longer. Dude, I'm totally still. All right, bioscan looks good. Woohoo! Oh, gonna pick up my funeral disease. Okay, I'm just kidding. I don't have. Ooh. Kind of nice. So yeah, this game does have a bit of a long introduction, admittedly. But uh, I mean, first time you play the game. Yeah, you do want to kind of check out the environment and. Please report to central administration. First time. You can just leave your bag there. I'll have it sent up your quarters. I'm the okay. strong silent type. I don't talk. There's things we need to take care of first. This is your personal data assistant. You'll need this to access all secure areas. If you get clearance for any security zones, it'll download directly. It's important, so don't lose it. I won't. I see here that Sergeant Kelly has requested your immediate attention. Head directly to Marine Command. Okay. It's just that way. Follow the signs. All right, so it, it gives you a little bit of an introduction to the PDA. <clears throat> Very important, you do get codes and other things, so you do want to uh, check that out. Now, what I found odd in this first game is you leave your duffel bag behind. There's no way to pick it up or anything. I guess they're, I guess they'll do it for you. 
Uh, so there's these videos, uh, you know, I'm not gonna sort of take time to watch them because uh, they're a little bit long. I'll give you a little flavor of it, now, for example. On behalf of the UAC, welcome to Mars City. This facility serves as the center. Which is pretty cool, actually. Uh, first time you play it again, you want to explore facility. all this stuff. Uh, again, interesting characters, but they don't hear. Because there seems to be some very serious problems. Oh, really? Do I need to remind you of the groundbreaking work that we're doing here? No. But I've been authorized by the board to look at everything. The board authorized you? Hmm. The board doesn't know the first thing about science. All they want is something to make them more money. Some product. Don't worry. They'll get their product. After how many accidents? Tell me, Dr. Petruger, why are so many workers spooked, complaining, requesting transfers off Mars? They simply can't handle life here. They're exhausted and overworked. If I had a larger, more competent staff and bigger budget, even these few accidents could have been avoided. I'm afraid you'll get nothing more until my report is filed with the board. I will need full access, Dr. Petruga, Delta included. I won't have any difficulties doing that, will I? Only if you get lost, Swan. Just stay out of my way. Amazing things will happen here soon. You just wait. Let's go. So it's kind of the classic story, the mad scientist and, you know, the little problem. The little problem, yeah, the gate to hell is open. Now, the nice thing about this game is you can skip all the cutscenes. I hate games where you can't do that. Oh, they drive me nuts. But here you can skip them, but I'm going to leave them in uh, just so you guys can see them. This is kind of cool. woo You can see yourself. Yay! Now, this also actually gives us a clue. Like, some people complain that Doom 3 was in first-person mode, but there's actually a way you can make it third-person. We'll look at uh, some of our modern uh, modding videos. Okay, you want to pick that thing up. Now, again, you can explore around, you can talk to these guys, but it's totally irrelevant. There's nothing there, so we'll skip over that. We want to go to Sergeant Kelly here. Weird. I mean, when you hear these guys talk, they talk about weird things happening and creepy things and people going crazy. And, hey, I like my job. Okay, what do we got? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's in Command HQ. Okay. All right, here we go, Command HQ. Now, the other thing is about this game is that uh, it, it is easy to get lost. So if I get lost, I'll just sort of do an edit, but because it doesn't give you waypoints or anything like that. Now, some people like that because it adds to the kind of the, uh, the, the the terror of the thing. But um, I don't know. Sometimes when you get lost, it's a little frustrating. But again, we can always do the magic of editing and get rid of some dead spots. So, All right, so Marine HQ. Ooh, cannon. Ooh, Gatling gun. Okay. Took your sweet time, Marine. Now, here's the situation. Another member of the science team's gone missing. Since you're the ranking FNG, you get to find him. I want you to check out the old decommissioned comm facility. We heard he might be heading that way. The only way there is through the service passage under Mars City. I programmed this sentry to guide you to the maintenance elevator. I hope you follow the sentry better than you've followed orders so far. You'll pick up some gear at the security checkpoint at the bottom of the elevator. Oh, and when you find him, just bring him back. Do not hurt him. Now move out. Why would I hurt him? Like, come on. All right, we're supposed to follow this guy, but I'm gonna race him. Da -da 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 -da. Come on, come on, buddy. I'm supposed to be falling. Walk away, walk away. I will follow. Okay. Ooh, there we go. Okay, so this game goes back to 2004. It was developed on the ID Tech 4 engine. Goes up to ID Tech 6 now. Quake 2016. But uh, back then, they built a lot of games on this engine. It was Doom 3, it was Doom 3 Resurrection of Evil, the BFG edition, we had Quake 4, Quake Wars, Wolfenstein 2009, and we had Brink 2011. We were all built on this engine. But uh, what's really amazing about this game is the original game ships with this powerful full-function editor. And it's so great that I just I can't resist doing a few videos on it to show you guys. And anybody that wants to mess around with some level editing, I would, I would employ you buy this game and check out that editor. I'll make a few videos on it and I'll show it to you guys, but you'll be totally blown away. Alright, so that PDA we picked up in the kitchen there is going to serve us well, so let's have a look. Adam Bernish. 
Um, I think it's in his This is the audio log voice. of maintenance technician Adam Bernache, dated November 10th, 2145. I fixed the couplings on the heat shields this morning with no problems. Oh, wait a minute. There it is. I did, however, have another uh, no, that's odd experience it. while I was down there. Shortly after finishing the first coupling adjustment, now I have to say I'm not nuts about these recordings because they go on and on and on. And yeah, they do get back or you does create ambience, but usually they give you the code the right at the very end. I was the only person scheduled to be in that area today. Yeah, yeah. That experience, coupled with the give me, stories give me, give of some guys over Let in the Delta in Labs, has me pretty freaked out. Ooh. I'm really beginning to hate going down to the underground maintenance area. The people down there are a bit off. The mumbling, the weird looks. The whole place is just plain creepy. Yep. I'm always expecting someone to jump out at me. I've secured my tools and the busted modulator in the storage cabinet next to the maintenance elevator. Give me, give me. Technicians should use cabinet code 396 to access. 396. Them. End of log. There we go. We got a couple of clips, although we don't even have a gun yet. See, no gun, just fists. Okay, we gotta go this way. Let's go in the elevator. Exit our city. All right. Ooh, I'm getting scared. I don't know if it comes across watching the playthrough, but when you're playing this game, there's a lot of shivers up the back of the spine, hair stand up on end moments, so. Welcome to the dungeon, Marine. Ooh, let me in here! Most unexciting oh. place on oh, Mars. Let me, let me, let me, give me. I'm gonna need you to grab some armor and secure your pistol before Absolutely. I can Absolutely, give me, give me, give me. Okay, grab your gear. Okay. Uh, what about the left one? Left, please. Left. You know, the hand you don't eat with? Okay, fine. Your stuff's in the store uh, now. You're ready for combat. I am. Let me do a radio test. Okay, radio test. <laughs> Marsec radio check. Excellent. Uh, Roger Wilco there, big buddy. Looks like you've been assigned the decommissioned comm facility. Yep. Just follow the main passage through the underground junction. And I will. Out. You'll have a quick evac. And what better way to see the Martian surface than to run across it? Okay, okay let me out set. Oh, yeah, yeah. Again, it's nice to explore, but... Down here. Don't get excited and shoot at me. Okay. Whoa. Talk to this guy, oh, see what he's got to say. I haven't say. seen anyone new down this way in quite some time. Well... Welcome to the dungeon, brother. Thanks, brother. Enjoy your stay. I will. Thank you very much. I'm just gonna do a little bit of practice. Ooh, the exploding barrel. I don't know if Ed actually invented the exploding barrel, but we certainly see it in a lot of games. It's in BF5. Okay, here we go. Hey. Oh, ugh, don't scare You're me like that. Damn it. Get yourself shot, I'm buddy. Not sure you want to Interesting, but totally irrelevant. Okay, here we go. Listen, Ooh. Scotty, I've done this a million times. It's not that hard. Why don't you crawl your fat ass down here and do it yourself? Hey, that's fatism. To make sure you do it. That's right. Give him heck. Just finish right. the couple. What do we got? Ooh. Okay, another PDA. Let's have a look. Again, you can read the text and the user emails or listen to the voice. I'm gonna. I always check the emails first because I don't want to listen to all that mumbo jumbo. Oh, we're gonna have to listen to it. No, no. Grant Bastion. Email. Give me, give me. Oh no. Oh, security code. Ooh, oh, 531. Thank you. Boo-hoo, 531. Ah, ah, shards. Ooh, shotgun shells. Oh, that's a good thing. Okay. The heck, a bag lunch? You know, Fallout 4, all these magazines are like gold. These are just, again, just decoration. All right. Ooh. Very cool environment. And again, the editor, we can build all this. This guy not keep any of these machines running? Yes, sir. Nope. It's just that the science team demands a lot out of these things. Enough yeah. excuses. Just do your job and get the science team what they need. So I was a taskmaster, eh? Jeez. Oh, Jesus! Do you make a habit of sneaking up uh, on people? There's Everyone's stuff down there, but down I'm... Here with all the I strange down things there. that have been going on. Not much. I'll grab a few shirts. There, I'm up to 75 armor. Thank you. Oh, let me up here. Oh, another exploding. Boom! Oh. See, it's telling you to use your flashlight. This could this created a lot of controversy because there's no way to actually have a weapon and a flashlight at the same time, so you kind of have to manage that. Uh, obviously, the developers did that on purpose. Now, later on, mods did come out where you could put the flashlight onto your weapons, but um, 
I don't know. I don't mind it. Yep. I am. I am hustling up. What's the big rush? Kelly's giving me a hard time. This guy's telling me to hustle up. Like, what the heck? Okay. Ooh, we're gonna go see Mars. See, the first time I saw this, it was very cool. Ooh, another barrel. But the only problem is there's no oxygen. It wouldn't explode. Oh, well. We must suspend this belief. Okay, here we go. Thank you. Okay, don't worry. We're almost there. The action's about to start. Don't worry. Just a little bit farther. I don't know why it's giving me a health here. I don't need any health. Any goodies? There's some goodies up here. Oh, oh. I don't need any of them, though. Ah, I could use the shards, but I don't know. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna use them. Marine, this is Sergeant Kelly. I know, I know, I know. Down there. Search your assigned area and haul your Jesus. ass back to Mars City. Out. Report him to personnel relations. Oh, Marine, though. Okay, always, always reload. Now, one thing I gotta do is have cursor discipline. Now, what does that mean? You gotta keep the cursor at head level. That's what real pro gamers do. Ooh. Huh? No, no, please. You must let me get this communication out. They have to be warned while there is still time. I can't let... I... You don't know what I've seen. You can't possibly understand or comprehend. The devil is real. I know. I built his cage. I'm getting abnormal readings here. This is bad. Oh, oh God! Gosh. Oh, no! Okay, this is cool. Very cool. Whoa, no! We gotta nail that guy, unfortunately, because he turns into a zombie. I know, I don't feel good about shooting him, but what are you gonna do? Alright, give me a weapon. Oh! Ooh. See, I just gotta shiver up the spine there. Oh! Headshot! Headshot! Bad guy! Ooh. Oh, this is Sergeant Kelly. We're under attack oh. by an unknown enemy force. Uh, back to Marine HQ all right, to regroup. Alright, let's take this guy out with our fists. Ooh, beautiful! That was, there's a right hand to the chin there. Nice. Okay. Let's get the weapon. Okay, stay away from the steam. Let's see like, again. Uh, Fall back like to caustic. Marine HQ and await further orders. Oh, man, that Kelly. I can't wait to shoot and frag his butt. Okay, we're into it. There's a lot of ambient sound, it's like really freaky. Ooh. Oh. Okay. Oh god. Oh god. Ah! Yeah, they give you a little... There's a lot of jump frights in this, jump scares in this game. Uh, you know what, I'm just gonna show you guys, you gotta, you can go up here and get these shards. And we'll get them. There we go. I don't really, yeah, I could use them, why not? Alright, take flashlight off. Recycle this thing. Woo, Mars! There's a section later we have to run around. We have to run around here, and you just have to look for the oxygen right there. Because you do run out of oxygen, you can see the oxygen counting down. Alright. Don't worry, I got this. This is fire team two. Ooh. Main power systems down and sub level. Backup and life support systems. Ah, one of the skull things. Ah. Yeah, it doesn't hurt you yet. They come on later, but okay. Command HQ attempting to secure the area. Oh, oh, headshot, headshot. See, the animations are kind of um, purposeful that they bob their heads, so it's not easy to get a headshot. But that was my buddy there. Oh man. Okay. All right, what's going on? Ooh. Whoa, that scared me. Nah, actually, I knew I was coming. Whoa. Takes a little swipe at you there. Come on, bro. I'm one of the living. Don't get me. Oh, jump. Code red is right. Code zombie. Ooh. This is kind of... Oh, the ham. This is kind of scary. Okay, this guy here. Whoa, whoa. Oh, oh. Oh, he's trying to swipe at us. Okay, so we went down there already. Okay, we gotta extend the bridge here. Ooh, 
Oh, guess running away. Report directly to Marine headquarters and await further orders. This bridge. What happened? Okay, take your time. Ooh. Very cool. Oh, I hear the radio. There he is. He's a shooter. Come on. Oh, headshot. Didn't stand a chance. Oh. Oh, sculpting! Oh no! Okay, there's a shooter. Yeah, we got him a couple times. Oh, he got us. Oh man. Oh! Come on, Tombo, get by him. There we go. See, the cursor turns red when you get him. Oh no, he's advancing. Oh, no. I can't believe I had so much problems with that guy. Alright. Yeah, 95 health. That's not bad. Okay, can't go in here. Oh no, get Okay, he's okay. Ooh, I'm gonna be all under the stairs. Oh my god! Ugh. That is so creepy. Ooh. Okay, we need this thing. Oh, there's some ammo. Okay, so there's some stuff up here. I'm actually not gonna bother with it. Uh, but what you do is these. these ooh, scary sound! Okay, that's just. Uh, what you do is you move one of these things over there. I'll show you real quick here. Okay, let's see. The physics. Woo. Now, again, you know, nowadays we, we take all this stuff for granted, but back in 2004, a lot of this stuff was new. Okay, uh, well, I kind of mucked that up. But anyways, you push that over, then you can jump up there. I trust in your abilities. Okay, let's open this. Okay, you gotta. You can help this guy here if you shoot the zombie. Oh, thank you. Unfortunately, you get nothing for it, but at least I saved the guy. Ah, don't sneak up on me like that! Oh, oh man. Ooh, I don't know. Yeah, that was kind of creepy. Alright, let's see what we got. Ooh, scary machinery. Okay, this this is a little frightening. Ooh, boom! See the brain flying! Oh, another one! Ooh, one, one, and ow! Ooh. Yeah, that red lighting is really creepy. Okay, one thing I have not been doing is saving, so I'm going to start saving regularly because I hate repeating levels, and I'm sure you don't want to sit here and watch me die all the time. All right, let's get going. What do we got here? Ooh, a little bit of health. Now, sometimes they hide guys in here. Okay, we're okay. Right. Oh, I got a shotgun now. That's just too fun. All right. Oh god. Oh, my hair stood up there. Oh. Oh, 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 it's melting. Okay, we're gonna kind of bait this guy in here because we want to get him with these barrels. Let's just make sure we can see. And oh, we blowed him up with the barrels. Nice. Okay. Gun. Let's go back to the pistol and reload. Oh, I hear the radio, man. Quick, quick, reload, reload, reload. I gotta get this guy with us. Die! Well, mine is already dead, so it's like the Walking Dead. Can't really say die because he's already dead. Die, dead one. Ooh. Oh yeah. Ooh, see, they come from behind. Gonna stand a chance. Bingo. Bingo. Ooh. Ooh, shit. Oh, goodies. Okay, so, yeah. Something bad coming up there. No, it's the guy with the eyes! Oh my god! Oh, he crawls up walls! Get the shotgun, shotgun, shotgun! Quick! Ooh, boom! Uh, if you get him in the head, it's usually one or two shots. Ooh, I got a station here. Uh, the station mechanic, it lo it's lumpy, okay? So it loads in 10. So, I mean, if you are too short, don't waste a whole 10 just for two. Anyway. Alright, what do we got? Uh, don't scare me like that. Oh. Reload, reload. Oh, I, heard a, I heard a monster. They go, Min? Min? Oh, there he is. Oh. 
Oh man, I love that lighting texture. We'll look how to do that. We're gonna, uh, what I meant to say is we'll look in the editor to see how we can make lights with nice textures like that. Oh, Min. Whoa! Oh, 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 I hear the guy. <gasps> yeah, I missed. Ah. Okay, that's a freebie. Okay, we're all full. We're good. We got this. Oh, oh. Oh, he got me with the fireball. Oh. See, if you get close to him, he goes into melee mode. And you can kind of kind of dodge him. It's, it's a little technique. Ow, oh, what? Somebody's shooting at me. Whoa! Where's that guy? Where is he? Where's the guy that was shooting at me? Oh. Oh, he's shot. I'm almost dead. Oh, man, I got ten. I'm gonna have to go back and get some health. Oh man, ten health. Oh, wait a minute. There we go. Okay, I'm topped up. I'm good. Save. Yeah, and uh, some of the guys, some of those uh, army guys, they drop bullets and weapons and stuff. So I'll just go back and check. Oh, the scary breathing. Okay, that's just a scary machine. But that breathing. Oh, can we go here? Oh, that was where the guy stuck his arm through before. Okay. Okay, what do we got? Oh, I'm on a run. Oh, uh, you can see, so so the action meter, you've only got so much run, so... Unfortunately, if I start to walk, it's... Oh, no, and I'm totally not ready for this guy. Oh, I'm totally not ready for the guy. See, I got distracted. Oh, get out of here. Oh, oh. Oh. That was pathetic. That was pathetic. Never go around a corner without the shotgun. And now I'm low on health too. Okay, if I die, that that's the way it is, guys. Sorry. I think there was a health here. Oh man. Oh there it is. Okay. Ooh, ooh, radio guy. Oh, oh, where is he? Oh got to dodge, dodge, dodge. We're playing ring around the rosy. Oh, he got me once though. Oh man. Ah. Okay, like I need serious health here. God, he's right. Oh, Fireball got me. Okay, I'm like down to 12 health. I really wonder whether I should go back. All units. Okay, we're gonna Sergeant save. Kelly. Probably we're not good to save against. with hardly any health, Repeat, but we have negative ID on the assailing force. I know. They're mean as so. Ooh, the, the guy. Back to HQ. Is he hanging up on ammo? Oh, establish a stronghold and keep him by his feet there. Okay, I'm very low health. I'm very, very concerned. Ooh. Okay, I got this. I remember this. Alright, come on. I think they kind of designed it that way. Fun, fun, fun. Whoa! Okay, I kind of knew that was going to happen, but it's still kind of scary. But the first time I played the game and that happened, that scared the bejesus, bejesus, bejesus out of it. How do you say it? Bejesus? Okay, Bravo team. Oh no, oh no, oh no, boom! Oh yes. Oh, there's a health station, thank goodness. Thank goodness. Okay, this guy, oh, it comes alive, oh no! Oh, he just stands there and he just shoots me merrily. Out. Oh. Okay, you want to go here and you want to open whatever you can because there's some. Oh, oh. Okay. So, uh, click on all these and make sure you open everything. This will help later, believe me. Okay, can't get in there. Maintenance, we're going to open that up. What else we got? Open, open, open. Airlocks can't do. Garage can't do. Okay, we're good. Save. Oh. Oh. See, being aggressive helps. Being aggressive helps. Looks like they have an animation to play first, so you got kind of a split second to get up on them, and then you can blast them away. Okay, just give me a second here. I just got to flip over to my other computer and just check our timing here. Just give me a moment. <clears throat> All right. Well, we're getting pretty close to the uh, time limit here. I'm going to go a little bit longer. Well, let's see if we can't get to a kind of a logical waypoint. All right. Let's go back. All right. Let's see if we 
can't get to a kind of a logical point here. Whoa! All you oh. see, this is Sergeant Kelly. Falls Fall out back of the to Marine HQ and await Ooh. further orders. Okay, you know we we press that uh, panel there, so it opened this up. And guess what, guys? We get a machine gun. Oh. Oh yes, the machine gun. All right, you know what? I think this might be a decent place to cut it off here because we're at about 30 minutes, so. All right, so we'll pick it up in the next round. I just want to thank everybody for watching this first part. We're going to go right through the entire game. Uh, please support us. Uh, drop us a sub or drop us a comment. Let me know. Um, did you play Doom 3 back in 2004? Did you enjoy it? Have you played Doom 2016? Are you interested in modding? So just uh, maybe drop us a comment, let us know what's going on, and uh, join the fun here. Okay, I'd like to thank you for watching. Join me for part two in a couple of days, and you stay well, and all the best.